welcome viewers today we feel privileged that a renowned scientist and a senior mentor professor r k kotnala will speak on a very crucial issue of phd students aspirations and related queries the accomplishments of professor r k kotnala is globally recognized for his outstanding contribution in green energy nano science material science and metrology his significant contributions are in hydroelectric cell solar cell spintronics multiferrox humidity sensors emi shielding and magnetic primary standards professor kotnala has published more than 528 research papers in well reputed international journals now let us listen to an eye opening session why should a student opt for phd after masters phd will provide a bright career and future in science it will also bring name and fame to the student and country it gives an international platform to make breakthrough invention it is it is evident from the whole world history that countries are empowered with science and technology are able to show their supremacy over others can you tell us the various ways to get admission in phd we should know for a phd admission students need to qualify in national entrance exam like net jrf gate iit or universities entrance exam otherwise also one can join project position in any research group to pursue phd what should we keep in mind while deciding the research area for phd you can decide research area of your passion and interest in frontier field of research with whom to pursue phd and which institution to be selected for research phd guide should have a good experience in diversified research field with international credibility from their own group irrespective of the institution what should be an ideal time frame for phd completion between 2 to 3 years sir please throw some light on the future prospects for a phd student the students can opt academic research institutions industry for a respectable position moreover one can emulate out hidden scholar within themselves after phd you are ready to solve societal problems by applying new scientific methodology as a supervisor what are your expectations from a student to optimize the time and efforts to do a big science in their phd tenure and finally to uplift the science and technology for the people what steps should a student take for more productivity in research students must make a sharp focus on innovative thinking to resolve research problems in a well defined frame it can be catalyzed by brainstorming within the group and fellow scholars when we start phd the first thing to do is to read the literature so how can a student identify good journals and do the literature survey effectively a student 
should look for a well reputed journal and work from a renowned group a research paper is highly valuable in the research field what according to you matters more quality or quantity of research papers always go for quality over quantity how often should a student interact with a guide or approach the guide for help students can approach guide any time any day what are the ways to increase the research understanding and article writing skills dear students read more and more relevant papers of your subject area and discuss within your group and seniors is it important to set a timeline during phd at what stage the student should publish their first research paper and at what stage should the student start writing thesis yes it is very important and first research paper should be published within one and a half year a student should start writing thesis after publishing two research papers if given a chance should the student opt for foreign lab visit yes a student must visit a foreign lab after two years of research how important is it to interact with your peers working in the same or different field is networking really important in the research field it is very important both networking as well as interaction with peers working in the same field are good for enhancing your research level what is the importance of attending seminars or conferences how many should one attend during phd tenure seminars and conferences provide exposure on latest research trend in your subject we know that experiments play a very important role in research please guide us with some common points we should keep in mind while planning any experiment dear scholar you must read basic working principle of the instrument first and carefully read and implement the operating instruction of any instrument you must know which property is to be investigated in your study beforehand before using the equipment can a student prepare for competitive exams during phd tenure remember the objective of the scholar should be research only so he she can prepare for any competition after completing assigned research work we have heard that for doing phd early students have to do personal chores for supervisors how much of this is true for doing phd some of the supervisors exploit this situation which is not ethical it is not expected from students to do personal chores for the supervisor but scholar must be truly involved in research with a total dedication sincerity and research integrity do you feel that students join phd only for the fellowship and not because they are interested in research many students feel that phd is an easy way to get money as well as 
हाइएस्ट एजुकेशनल डिग्री ड्यू टू दिस रिसर्च क्वालिटी इज बैडली एफेक्टेड हाउ कैन स्टूडेंट्स कीप देम सेल्व मोटिवेटेड एंड एनकरेज टू डू देर बेस्ट स्कॉलर शुड रीड अबाउट दी एफर्ट्स बिहाइंड एनी ग्रेट इन्वेंशन बाई द साइंटिस्ट कंट्रीब्यूशन फ्रॉम स्कॉलर इज ए ग्रेट सर्विस टू द नेशन एंड द सोसाइटी वट शुड बी अ गोल बाई अर्निंग अ पी एच डी डू यू रियली वॉन्ट टू बी अ ग्रेट साइंटिस्ट और अकेडमिशन बाई लर्निंग समथिंग और इज इट जस्ट अनदर डिग्री your goal should be to become a great researcher or academician after earning phd to achieve global level in science and ultimately to improve the economy of the nation how to know the inherent talent to do a big science during phd inherent talent to do big science can only be realized when we keep on doing science with an open mind by utilizing the fundamentals in generously never give up to any failure faced during research work problem keep on taking failure as good feedback what is the ultimate satisfaction for a researcher value addition to science and contribution to the society is the ultimate satisfaction for a researcher how to keep oneself determined to be an outstanding scientist or academician don't get disheartened by the failure of the experiments even the great scientists sacrificed a lot to accomplish scientific passion good luck science wonders aise hi science ke topics lata rahega kripya चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करना ना भूलें